What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another one. In today's video, we've got the five best assault rifle loadouts for Season 5 of Warzone 2. In this video, I'm going to be breaking down the five assault rifle classes that you need to be using on this season of Vondel Park to absolutely fry. Now, granted, two of our assault rifles that I'm going to show you are technically battle rifles. I don't want to hear it in the comments. They are assault rifles. It's the same thing. Hope you guys enjoy the video. If you guys want to see more gameplays like this live, we're live every night over on the Twitch. It'll be the first link in the bio, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, first up, we have the Cronin Squall. This is probably the meta assault rifle in the game at the moment. We're going to have the Sock and Tread Muzzle on this, tuned to Recoil Stabilization and Recoil Control. The F-Tac Ripper Underbarrel, tuned to Recoil Stabilization and Aim Idle Stability. The 50-Round Drum. The SZ Recharge DX, tuned to Flinch Resistance and FAR. And last but not least, the HR 6.8 Barrel tuned to recoil steadiness and damage range okay bro like the confidence is is guns quick down i probably shouldn't give up my really good positioning for one kill here I'll wipe the uh next up we've got the tac v what i really like about the tac v is that there are two options here you can either run the iron sight with high velocity rounds or you can run a sight personally i prefer the sight but the iron sight is extremely clean on this weapon if you want to use it we use the bore muzzle tuned to recoil stabilization and recoil control the f tag ripper tuned to recoil stabilization and aim idle stability the 50 round drum I like to use the SZ Recharge DX on all of my assault rifles. So I have this tuned to flinch resistance and far. And the 18-inch precision barrel tuned to recoil steadiness and damage range. But if you did want to get rid of the sight and use the iron sight, you could add the high-velocity bullets and you can tune them for damage range and bullet velocity. I hope so, because I uh, would like to use my account in Modern Warfare 3. You know, I'd like to get that mastery camo. About a month. So we're hoping that something happens. I don't know. Probably number nine. Take the mask off, motherfucker. Holy shit. Oh, what the fuck? Game is not over. The jailbreak. Then the game. Next up, we have the Castoff 545. On this weapon, we have the Komodo Heavy Muzzle tuned to recoil stabilization and recoil control. The IGK30 406mm barrel tuned to recoil steadiness and damage range. I like to rock the Cronin Mini Pro on this, a bit of a smaller sight tuned to aim down sight speed and far. High velocity bullets tuned to damage range and bullet velocity. And last but not least, the 60 round magazine. 
See this guy? Jeez. Good shots. Secure that kill. to say doesn't this whole team have to move Moving here. no two there's one Curtis Smith is not getting it 31 personal favorite of mine has always been the M4A1 and it still remains one of my favorites. We have the RF Crown 50 muzzle tuned to recoil stabilization and recoil control. The high tower 20 inch barrel tuned to recoil steadiness and damage range. The aim op V4 tuned to flinch resistance and far. The 60 round magazine and the F-TAC ripper tuned to recoil stabilization and aim idle stability. Four times. We're actually, don't wipe, dude, because we're actually in, like, a world record lobby. Your cam is insane, Eric. I'm not gonna lie. Thank you. Hold on, stay by the back for a sec. I'm about to make a dumbass play. Never mind, I'm good. I hear him. I think they're in here. Is it you? Are you the annoying one? You are. Pack your ass up, boy. The last weapon we're going to cover here is the Iron Sight TAC-56. This thing is an absolute beam. We're going to have the Echoless 80 muzzle tuned to recoil smoothness and bullet velocity. The Tundra Pro 17-inch barrel tuned to recoil steadiness and damage range. The F-TAC Ripper tuned to recoil stabilization and aim idle stability. High velocity bullets tuned to damage range and bullet velocity. And last but not least, the 60-round magazine. Yeah, I'm not trying to I could have died. This one's got less recoil. I could die here. Yeah, where my UAV at, man? We don't have the YouTube video out yet. Bro, what am I looking at? Dude, the sky is just like... Oh my God, 
Bomb protection is OP, bro. You don't have a UE, do you? No, but you got a good one. I can buy one. I'm buying one. Just... And I'll see you guys in the next one.